Hello everyone, it's Dr. Leo Kormanik with Ohio Sports Chiropractic. I'm going to go show you right now some exercises for an acute low back. The first one is basically a side plank. Uh, the key being here, you're going to go off your knees and you're going to go on your elbow and you're going to put your hand right here in the shoulder to make sure you're not kind of moving your shoulder like this, which is damaging to the shoulder. So you're going to rock up. You should feel the muscle contract right through here. And basically you're going to hold this for eight to 10 seconds. Okay. And it should be a nice, good contraction right through here. And then basically after eight to 10 seconds, just drop back down and do about 10 reps of that. Now, again, this is for an acute low back. So these are for people that are really in immense amount of pain with their back. You're going to do this because you're going to try to get the back to muscles on the obliques to activate better and take pressure off the actual low back muscles that are screaming at you. So again, eight to 10 seconds there. Then we're going to lay on your back. Then you're going to have one knee bent and then we're going to do hands behind your back and you're going to keep your back the same arch that it is in a non-painful position. So you're going to place your leg however you need to so your back is not painful and then just arch up just a little bit, almost like you're lifting your sternum straight up and you're going to hold that for eight to 10 seconds. So keeping, making sure to keep your neck nice and relaxed. Okay. And then you're going to switch legs. Again, you're going to do about 10 reps of that. Just lifting up like an inch or a couple inches back here, lifting your sternum up, contracting your core, and holding it for eight to 10 seconds. If you feel as though your neck is working too hard on that one, just do this, support just a little bit, and then really just try to be cognizant of how your back is, just making sure that you don't lose that curvature. Okay. The last one is uh, bird dog, something that we've all seen before. This is going to help engage the transverse spinalis group or the multifidi of the back, which is important for issues with the disc or an acute low back, basically when you're in a lot of pain. So you're going to find kind of a neutral, non-painful position for your back here. Then once you find it, you're going to initially start with just by moving your arm and you kind of, you're going to alternate. You're going to kind of get up to 20 reps for this. If you feel like this is too easy, then try the legs without moving the arm. And again, just making sure that you're not like arching the back with the leg movement. So just again, just lifting the leg up like that and alternate. If you find that that is too easy as well, then you're going to add in the third option, which is basically you're going to make sure that you're nice and stable through your core and you're gonna alternate arm and leg movement at the same time, okay? Now, these are basic, easy exercises, I get that, but when you're in acute pain within the back, you have to get your brain to wake up all of these muscles through here so it doesn't just keep cranking on the muscles back here, which further creates compression within the back. So again, these are for acute low back scenarios. If you find that these are too easy and too basic, then you could advance on to kind of some of your traditional uh, core exercises. But again, this is for when you are in a lot of pain to wake up these muscles. And then also somebody that is just starting any core work. If they've done no core work, you know, over the last couple of years, this is another great way to just kickstart that process as well. Again, be sure to uh, subscribe to our channel and be sure to like our videos and uh, uh, give us some feedback on what you think. Thanks.